This is gun dashing. And it's the closest thing we're probably ever going to get to wave dashing in Smash Ultimate. In this video, I'm going to do my best to break down exactly how it's done and its practical applications. Joker is the latest DLC character for Smash Ultimate, and with him, he brings the unique ability to dash during his neutral special, aptly called Gun. He can dash a maximum of 5 times between shots. On the ground, it's pretty much comparable to rolling, and it's actually faster. The only downside being that you're limited to using your gun afterwards, and it has less invincibility frames. But for this video, we're going to be focusing on the aerial version of this, because just like on the ground, Joker can dash in between shots in the air as well. This allows him to execute the dash just above the ground, negating the limitation of having to use his gun afterwards and giving him incredible mix-up potential. And while this is infinitely faster than using a directional air dodge, there is still some lag when you hit the ground before you're able to act. But there is a way to make this completely 100% lagless, it just requires a lot of practice and near frame perfect timing. When you fire your gun, you will notice that Joker switches between three different stances every three shots. One, two, three, reset. One, two, three. What you want to do in order to gun dash is to short hop and time your shot in such a way so that when you land, you hit the ground just before you're able to enter your second stance. After you fire, immediately flick and hold the stick in the direction you are facing. If you timed your shot correctly, you will slide forward as soon as you hit the ground and be able to act freely afterwards with no lag whatsoever. Pretty sick, right? And yes, this works with Arsene too, you just need to adjust your timing to accommodate for the extra shots. The application for this are basically what you can already do with Joker's Air Dash except with more efficiency. You can use it to directly approach your enemy. as a means of faking them out, or as a means of crossing them up. Just remember, you can only gun dash forwards, not backwards, so it's not as flexible as wave dashing from melee. This is where your usual means of air dashing comes in handy. It's not as fast as perfect gun dashing, but you have more freedom of movement. But that's it. Let me know what you think about this new tech in the comments and whether you have any success with it. I look forward to seeing what other people may be able to do with this, because I haven't been able to test whether you can do this with more than one shot, mostly because I really can't be bothered. I have a full guide on Joker's moveset in the works too, so make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. In the meantime, head on over and check out my other breakdowns on characters and tech for Smash Ultimate, Dragon Ball Fighters, and soon to be Mortal Kombat 11. Take care, and I'll see you in the next one.